the second question is show that the lines whose dcs are given by l plus m plus n is equal to 0 let it be equation 1 the second relation is 2mn plus 3nl minus 5lm equal to 0 we can prove that those two lines are perpendicular to each other the given relations let it be equation 1 and equation 2 from 1, L equal to minus of M plus N substitute in equation 2. 2MN plus 3N into minus of M plus N minus 5 into minus of M plus N into M equal to 0. Here 2 m n plus into minus minus 3 n m plus 3 sorry plus into minus 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 into plus minus minus 3 n square minus into minus plus 5 m minus into minus plus into plus plus 5 n m here m into m m square equal to 0 here 5 m square 2 minus 3 minus 1 plus 5 that is plus 4 m n minus 3 n square equal to 0 this is divides with the n square why because reduced into quadratic equation that is 5 5 m square by n square plus 4 m n by n square minus 3 n square by n square equal to 0 n square n square cancel 1 n 1 n cancel from this 5 into m by n whole square plus 4 into m by n minus 3 equal to 0. It is equation 3, just I am giving the clue. It is in the form of ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. From this, the uh, alpha, comma, beta are roots of ax plus ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 then alpha plus beta is equal to minus b by a and alpha beta product of the roots equal to c by a by taking off that here we are taking let m1 by n1 and m2 by n2 are roots of equation 3 then the product of the roots m1 by n1 into m2 by n2 equal to c by a that is minus 3 by 5 from this m1 m2 by n1 n2 equal to minus 3 by 5 m1 m2 equal to minus 3 n1 n2 by 5 substitute in equation 1. m1 m2 equal to minus 3 n1 n2 okay this is the one set we cannot substitute in any other equation suppose it is the some fourth equation we are taking Next, again, we can take from first equation m1, m2 by n1, n2 equal to minus 3 by 5. Okay. Again from 1, m equal to 
minus L of minus L minus N substitute in equation two. Then we are getting the relation of Ln. So equate the M1, M2 by N1, N2 and Ln relations. Here two in the place of M minus L minus N into N plus three N L minus five L M is minus L minus N equal to zero minus 2ln minus 2n square plus 3nl minus into minus plus 5l square minus into minus plus 5ln equal to 0. Here 5l square my plus two plus three plus five. It's a plus ten L N minus two N square equal to zero. Divide with N square. Five L by N whole square plus ten into L by N minus two equal to zero. Again, we can take L one by N one and L two by N two are roots of above equation. So product of the roots L1 by N1 into L2 by N2 equal to C by A minus 2 by 5. From this L1, L2 by N1, N2 equal to minus 2 by 5. Here M1, M2 by minus 3 equal to n1 n2 by 5 and l1 l2 by minus 2 equal to n1 n2 by 5. So therefore l1 l2 by minus 2 equal to m1 m2 by minus 3 equal to n1 n2 by 5. The what are the relation of the Perpendicularity L1, L2 plus M1, M2 plus N1, N2. Suppose let it be it is K or N1, N2 equal to it is equal to K means this is minus 2K minus 3K plus 5K equal to 0. So 0 equal to 0. This, it satisfies the relation. Therefore, the lines L1 and L2 are perpendicular to each other. This is the relation.